Good evening. We arrived late, so it's a little dark. But we got a lot of things going for dinner tonight. First, um, I made some vegan chili. And so we're gonna, I, we dehydrated it so we could go camping. And now we're gonna rehydrate it. Uh, then we're gonna go on to mashed potatoes. And the big winner for me, Ryan's gonna eat the chili and the mashed potatoes. And campsite catering was my old gig. We're going to move on to a cullen skink. Um, it's kind of a cross between clam chowder and a cullen skink. Let's turn this off here. And um, so we're going to have some smoked baby clams right here. That's going to be mixed in with a mashed potato base. And then, uh, yeah, I got to keep the, the ingredients a little separate on the hike, but I got ghee in here. I got uh, powdered milk, some onion flakes, and a little bit of garlic, and salt and pepper, spices. Mm -hmm. So we're going to see how this turns out. I have not done this with the smoked clams, but this is the best we're going to try with a Cullen sink on the camp on the road. All right, so let's start by starting the rehydration process. Try not to burn myself with jet oil. Mm -hmm. uh, this is leathery. We dehydrated it to a leather. And we'll probably add some more chili to that while that sets up. That's going to probably be pretty mushy. All right, mushy. All right. Let's get your mashed potatoes going. I might have to do it. Another boil here. Now this is heavy duty plastic. Some of you are going to cringe, but yes, it's hot water. Oh, it's going to be okay. I've done this before. It's not supermarket plastic. This is industrial plastic. Around. It's going to need a little more water in a bit. Oh, man. And we'll get another boil going because we don't have enough. Just can't get enough. Just can't get enough. I'm also over here just absolutely plowing through the dehydrated bananas we made. These are also uh, leathery. I'd say actually they're more of a jerky. And uh, yeah, we just took a couple bananas and dehydrated them. Way better than banana chips. Right, so that should get our process started here. Now this is gonna be a soup, so I'm gonna end up making a full, full helping of this. Let's get the, give this a little stir. Okay, yeah, that ghee is going to start to melt here. Oh, so excellent. Now, obviously, I don't want to do this in the cooking pot because that'll be a nightmare to clean. And we carry out all of our garbage. So I got a lot of, a lot of garbage bags going. The stars are out. We're having a hard time lighting a fire. Every, all the wood around here is wet. <laughs> All right, so uh, we'll tune in uh, tomorrow morning, see how it all turns out. Although I guess I should open this up. You don't want to not open the smoked clams up. Smoked clams in sunflower oil. Sunflower butter? Yeah, I want to do this without cutting myself into a... Look at that, huh? That is just tasty. Highly recommended for the trail. <laughs> yeah. Amazing. All right. So we're going to let the uh, Cullen sink here. The onions have to dehydrate a little bit. So we're going to do another boil, put it all together. Oh, what the hell? I'll give it a go. You, you, how's your chili? Your chili hasn't dehydrated yet. Rehydrated. Rehydrated. You want to uh, see how that's going? No, I got 
tell you a nice thing about these smoked clams. I've done smoked oysters uh, that you're supposed to put a little oil in here. That's the ghee, but they're packed in oil. I can use the... Little, they're just jumping out. Little clammies go. This is pretty hard to do given our limited light and space. Light and space. Yeah, the vegan chili is rehydrating real well. Yeah. And how's that taste? Amazing. It tastes amazing. You got beyond beef in here, not real beef. And uh, it's a good texture. Original secret, mushroom broth. Oh, yeah. Mushroom broth instead of chicken broth. All right, let's see how this starts off. Got to have a taste on the camera here. A couple of these little clam guys. Mm. Wow, well, it's thin. Thin. Um, thin, yeah. I need a little more mashed potatoes. You want some more? But I guess it's supposed to be pretty thin. I mean, it's just a soup after all. There's definitely too much oil on the top. I can do without the ghee because the oil that comes with the clams. Mm. So, hint for the future, no ghee. That means I can have pretty much all dried ingredients plus the clams. We're going ghee-less. And I got ghee instead of clarified butter. Well, I'm just looking for oil, so. But ghee is a little little burnt, so it's going to add to the smoky flavor. Mmm. That's going to do. All right. Well, to a good dinner. <laughs>